Hey guys, welcome back to the game replay. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Final Fantasy V for the Game Boy Advance. Uh, okay, so you know, I gotta tell you, I'm not sure what that deserted temple's all about. Um, if you want to let me know about that one, feel free. That would be cool. Uh, yeah, the deserted temple place thing, the ruins in the middle of this desert. Uh, it seems to me like... Well, at least for the moment, there's nothing to do there. Of course, you know, I'm sure there's gonna be something to do there. Sometime! 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 Uh, but let's just plow our way through here. Um, there's gotta be another route. Do you say route or route? You gotta kinda keep an eye on the... <laughs> on the desert. I saw a cactus over there. Aim, Rosa! I'm used to Rosa and her aiming. It helps! So I would imagine it would help here. 481 Ferris's uh, bow and arrows did. Not gonna get another uh, chance to see the, <laughs> the difference. 481? Alright, we'll try next time though. Hmm. So, oh. Hmm. Where, where do you think I should go? I want to kind of go to, like, the rightish side. Okay, regular attack. Uh, I think it was a different enemy, though, last time. Whoa, whoa! Well, that's 533. And I think they even tell you kind of what the aiming's all about and the abilities and such, right? You know? Raise the ac- Yeah, okay, raise the accuracy of the attack. So... It's accuracy, it's not like strength, I suppose. I guess for those hard shots? Yes, the hard shots. Hmm. Man. Run! Run. Run. Hey, look, everyone, uh, you need the run. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Oh, I think I did a bad, bad thing. I want to get more to the right. Think I did a bad, bad thing. Now, I mean, I don't really know what this desert consists of. I could have started this next part. Ugh. I could have started this next part, like, at the end of the desert thing. You know, the end of this area. But, you know, I don't know how much there is to it. There could be a lot to it, so... Alright, well, I'm gonna go down here. Hopefully this is a good, good thing. Insta-kill? Still not totally sure what- is that stop? Isn't that- that's something. Remember Shadow and his assassin dagger and Final Fantasy? Oh, it wasn't his. Locke could use it. Who else could use it? Eh, some- certain people could use it. Couldn't Strago use it? Who could use daggers in Final Fantasy VI? Well, I mean, a lot of people could use daggers, I believe, actually. Yeah. Daggers were, like, for a lot of the people. Alright, man. Um, this way? I hope I'm not going the exact same route. I'm kinda- I'm over it! I'm over it. I'm over these monsters here. I'm over it. I don't really like that phrase. I don't, I don't like. Uh, I don't like saying that. Do you ever? Do you ever like dislike certain phrases? You know, like oh, I'm over it, or uh, I don't know. I can't think of any more, and I should be able to. Okay, well that looks promising. How do we not screw this up here? <laughs> uh. uh, uh. That might be the exit. Why can't I think of more phrases? Uh... What's good for the goose is good for the gander. Turnabout is fair play. Uh, what else? Well, the point is... I don't know. Do certain phrases just kind of like... Ugh. Please don't say that. Like, look, we gotta get out of dodge. That one kind of annoys me. Do I'm not in dodge. I don't, no, I don't need to get out of dodge. I'm not in dodge in the first place. Some of you may not even know... Some of the ones I'm uh, mentioning right now. Mm-hmm. Very good. Uh, 
Uh, that way. Okay. <laughs> well. Okay, I guess I'm through. The desert of the shifting sands, man. Kind of a pain. Uh, there's still a little more desert to go. You know which one uh, I kind of like? Sometimes I like to treat myself. That's kind of a, a phrase, a saying. It could be phrases, sayings, you know. Certain things you hear in television a lot. Stuff like that. You know, certain phrases. This and that. Okay, well this is it. This is the little town down here. Is this a deserted type of town? Is there gonna be an ancient civilization here? What are we gonna find here? Well, let's go in. Yeah. This is gone. <laughs> it's gone, the town of ruin. Gone, the town of ruin? Meh. It's gone, the town of ruin. All right. I guess this is that town of ruin Sid was talking about. Okay. And and, and then? <laughs> How did he know? How did Sid know what he what he knew and then why didn't he know more? Well, we can walk kind of fast here. Yeah, it's a it's a town of ruin. There could be secrets here. There could also be booby traps here. <laughs> Uh, I don't know where to start here. Th that was... King Tycoon? The hell? King Tycoon's here. Last time we saw him, I don't know, he was... zapped away or flew away or... It's been a long time, actually. I can't totally remember. So at this point, we're playing hide-and-seek with King Tycoon? So where'd he go? King Tycoon? We're really playing hide-and-seek. So I know about X-Death or whatever, and he's, uh... Just like in Final Fantasy IV, there's like manipulations and possessions going on, man. Like the Queen and uh, who else? Do these little scenes need to be activated before I can like probably proceed upward to the middle and the important area of this place? Maybe, maybe not. We're after uh, King Tycoon. He's ghosting. Kinda, not, not really. Yeah, there's uh, it's a whole lot of nothing really here. Hmm. <laughs> Broken tree, kind of. Yeah, let's head up up here. What is he doing, man? <laughs> there he is. Well, something seems fishy. Booby trap or King Tycoon or not. Let's get to the bottom of it. Father! P P Papa? <gasps> ah! Ferris! I knew it! You really are my sister! I I'm sorry. I wasn't certain at first, and then I didn't think I should tell you. Sister! Lena. Ugh. Ugh. Hmm? Ugh. Ugh, where are we? 
This place is strange. Uh, say, what happened to the old man? Huh? Uh, he's not here? We must have gotten separated when we fell. Uh, he'll be okay. Uh, he's a tough old cuss. I'm sure we'll run into him again later. Come on, let's get going. Yaha! Hey! Now wait one cotton picking minute! That was an awfully quick decision to ditch me! Yikes! Uh, sorry! <laughs> Jeez! So, for no reason right there, I, w were we really gonna ditch Gallif? Come on, guys. Oh man, the serious music. So, Ting, so, uh, King Tycoon didn't say anything, by the way, and they didn't really even question it. It was just, it's kind of a quick scene there, actually. Uh, oh, we're sisters, I knew it. Oh man, it's crazy. Where's Gallif? Ah, the hell with him, let's go. Hey! Oops, our bad. We were kind of ditching you. Oh, sorry. But then, like, okay, that's all. Well, shouldn't we discuss more about, you know, sisters? How did you get separated? What's up with King uh, Tycoon there? Where are we exactly? And uh, I don't know. Who cares? Let's go. A lot of gears. What is this? Look out! Ugh. Ugh. Meanwhile... East, west, home is best. Even if you're a chocobo, huh? Bart should be thrilled. We went above and beyond the call of duty. Poof, that was close. I suppose that was a warp device. After not being used for so long, activating it must have caused an overload. It's a little too dangerous to go back in there. I hate mid. Has there ever been another mid in the Final Fantasy universe? Because that's kind of crazy when you think about it. Like, Sid has a grandson, and I don't know, mid, man. Mid? Then again, Sid... Jeez, man. Oh, wow, I gotta think. Back to it, Sid had a daughter in Final Fantasy IV. Um... Right? Yeah. And it was just some, like, nobody, no-named character, right? Just some, just some girl character that was in the town of Baron, you know? Yeah. Sid had a daughter himself, and did she do anything? She might have done a thing or two. God, it's embarrassing that... I can't even remember anymore. It's been a while since I played. The last time I played that game was when I did a walkthrough of it in 2008. So, you know, I mean... Hmm, what's the deal with this place? What's this? There's a switch here. Push the switch. No! Well, that's locked, so... Eh. Well, let's try this first. Ah! Um... Rest up a bit. Hey, why the hell not? If you, if you come across beds in your life, just lay in them. Take a nap. You know? Just do it. Righto. Good stuff. 
Let's look at the rest of this place. Mmm, treasure? Treasure. There's a switch here. Let's push this one too. Yeah. Yeah. It won't budge. Huh? Something is carved into the wall. Check the planners in the center room. Okay. Got a little scavenger hunt kind of wild goose chase thing here. Planners. No. Don't rest up. Shut up. Planners in the center room. Oh, there's a note here. The notepad in the room on the right. So what is this place still? Notepad room on the right. Made you look neener, neener, neener. Ugh. I'm little. Uh, calm down, Barts. Eh, hey, yeah. Before you get your pantaloons in a twist, uh, take a look. Uh, there's another note. Check the urn. Hmm. What urn? Check the urn. The urn? This urn? No. Urn. Urn. Where is there an urn? Over here? Ah. Hey, there's a little frog! What's he doing? Go down six and right four, then pull what's there. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four. Uh, yeah, very good. There's a switch here. Pull the switch! <laughs> uh, okay. Well, sometimes you just have to go through the process there, don't you? Learn mini! Um, okay. Kind of a silly spell. I mean, who plays Final... Okay, so, those of you watching, alright, you love Final Fantasy games. Whatever's your favorite. You know, you got one, two, three, four, five, a million and a half. Uh, there's many. The spell of many is in a bunch of them. Is that, is that the spell that you can't wait to get? To acquire, to learn, to master, whatever, man? Yeah, mini! Yeah! Now I'm unstoppable! No, nah, you... <laughs> Mini, come on. No one cares ever about Mini. Well, I suppose we should push this switch. How long has that frog been here? Is he, is he a lot? Is he real? Like, what does he eat? Oh, well, whatever. I mean, there is greenery down here. So there's a switch here, and we'll push this. Huh? Huh? Well, oh, safe spot. Boss battle coming up, maybe? This is... Hey! Hey, it's the fire-powered ship! I thought it had sunk! But what's that ship over there? <laughs> Hold on. So, the fire-powered ship is here, and, uh, can we actually still go down here? Well, that's weird. I thought... Oh, yeah, we had the little scene here, didn't we? I thought I recalled hearing or reading or whatever that it's important to go back down here. I don't know why. Perhaps if my memory could be jogged. Like, why? Why? Tell me why. Why do we need to go down here again? Let me a comment. Let me know. I am asking you. Alright. But not now. We're not doing this now. I assume, I imagine we can uh, come back here anytime now. So we can drive around the oceans. Dr drive around the oceans. What is this ship? Hmm. Propellers on a boat? 
What's up with that? Ah! Sid! Mid! Oh! Uh, what the? It. Bartz? Lena? Ferris? Galf? What are you guys doing here? Hmm. I think that's our line. Where'd you guys come from? We rode the Black Chocobo back to Crescent Island. Then all of a sudden, a hole opened up beneath us, and we fell. Uh, wait, so we're underneath Crescent Island? Mm-hmm. Well, that explains the fire-powered ship being here. This place must have been built by the ancients. Huh. And this propeller ship? Uh... Maybe you should ask Grandpa about that. Huh? Uh, wait, where'd he go? Hmm. I think, it, I think it went down below. And then you did, and... Eh. Now I'm going to. So is this our airship, folks? It seems like it's gonna be an airship. Oh, boy. What's down here, then? Trouble? Hot diggity dang! This is mind-blowing! Uh, hey, Sid? Uh, don't bother me, boy -o. Tighten this, and adjust this, righty tighty, lefty loosey. There you go. Voila! That should do it. That should do what? That should get this ship moving. Wow! Amazing! We got our airship in the air, everybody. It's pretty awesome. Sid, what is this thing? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? It's an airship! Amazing! I've only ever seen these in old texts. I can't believe I'm getting to use one in the flesh. Uh, uh, well, y you know what I mean. Oh. What, what was that? Something's dragging us down! Creeping crawdads! Some monster's got a death grip on the ship's hull! About time! About time! Tail screw, don't do that. What'd he do? Oh no! So this is... A dead enemy. Uh, there you go. <laughs> oh, yeah. Throwing, throwing weapons is awesome. A lot of damage. Good stuff. Uh, I was gonna say, yeah, about time we have a boss battle, and then we're done. Ah, oh, good stuff. Frostbow, huh? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Looks like that overgrown lobster just got served! With cheese biscuits and mashed potatoes! <laughs> ah, looks like damage to the ship was minimal. Hmm. We can use parts from the fire-powered ship to make the airship good as new. Hmm. It's Sid. Ah, if you're just gonna thank me, I don't need to hear it. We'll stay here and search for some clues about the Earth Crystal. The skies are yours, kids! Now get out there! Eh, the evil warlock X-Death. We must prevent him from returning. All that's left is the Earth Crystal. Hmm. No point in dawdling. Let's go!
awesome. Where do I go, though? Hmm. So I can't hit, like, the back button and I can land here. <laughs> it's kind of weird, actually. Yeah, I can land there. You can't, like, you know, back out into, like, a scene where you're on the ship. You can do that in Final Fantasy VI. And I guess, well, I'm not through this whole game yet. Well, actually, no, you could do that in Final Fantasy IV on the big whale. Not the regular airships, but you could on the big whale. The big old whale. Remember the big old whale? Yeah. You could do that. You could exit into, um you know, one of your flying contraptions, you know, one of your vehicles, yeah. I mean, yeah, you can do that here, I guess, but I'm just saying you have to, like, land. Now, you could go into the airship while it was landed, or not landed in Final Fantasy VI, but did you have to be landed in Final Fantasy IV? That's, like, a very minor, silly thing that, why would you, like, remember that? Why would you, why would you have that fact, unless you kind of just played the game, or, I don't know. And I have not recently played the game. It's been since 08, like I said, right? What am I even talking about? Ah, oh, man. Oh, was that my, uh, Moz? Moz earlier? <laughs> and, uh, yeah, let's just talk about whatever the hell I want. I was at uh, my Moz earlier, and every time I go there, I hate myself because I just I totally raid the fridge, and then I eat, like, a bunch of food because it's kind of, it's free! <laughs> I, like, I eat all her food, kind of. Not all her food, but I totally, like, just pick out, and then I get home, and I hate myself. Because I just, I eat, I eat a bunch of unnecessary things, and I'm just so mad at myself. Because, you know, I'm not buying, I'm not buying these items. I'm not buying Triscuits. I'm not going to buy any Triscuits. <laughs> no. I have no use for Triscuits in my life. Or would you, would you rather me talk about the big whale in Final Fantasy IV, and whether or not you can board it while in the air, or just while it's stationary. Yeah, man, Triscuits. Oh, yeah, who doesn't love a Triscuit? You know, made with some cheese on it, or pepperoni slice, or whatever, man. I don't care what you put, put on, uh, peanut butter. Oh, my God, peanut butter. M&M's. I don't know what you're doing, man. Bologna. Yeah, yeah, sure. You can put a lot on a Triscuit. But I got no, got no use for Triscuits in my life, man. I'm, I'm trying to stay healthy and slim. Oh, I, I hate going the, like, over to family. Ugh. Anyway, let's talk to Sid in mid here. Ah, oh, great googly moogly! What a discovery! <laughs> what, would you, what do you want to hear me talk about? So many books, so little time! Yeah, man. Sid in Final Fantasy IV had a daughter. Totally underutilized, I believe. Might as well sleep... Oop, uh, sleep up here. What should I do? Um. Hmm. 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 Well, why don't we just take the airship out? Maybe. I don't know. Maybe we'll see. Um. Isn't. Hmm. Okay. So I, I can see why there's a save spot here, and it kind of yeah it makes sense now, huh? That's, yeah, that, this is like the docking part, and then I guess we can take the ship. I guess not now. Maybe not ever. Yeah, I don't know, man. I really don't know. But, yeah, we leave our docking port place, whatever, and then take to the skies. That looks, it's like a little garage in the ocean. So where do I go, dude? That's me. Hmm. Okay, so that's the Earth Shrine, right? Gotta be. I can't get there. I don't know where to go. Should we go back to the... Should we go back to the ruins? I don't know why. Oh! What's going on? Oh, look! The town! Uh, 
dude, something just... Was that the Zeal Fortress from Chrono Trigger? Is that going to be in the skies no matter what time period we're in? Oh, it's not really this game. Um, I don't see any new... There's no new blinkies on the map screen. I don't think so, anyway. Maybe we should go back and check in with uh, Sid and Mid. Probably. I was just there, but then this stuff just happened. A flying fortress thing. I don't know, guys. We'll get to it, but not right now, because right now, I'm going to call it a wrap right here. Awesome stuff. Enjoying this game very much. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, of course. Leave me those comments. Tell me what you think. Like always, everyone, you can follow me on my social media pages, including my Patreon. The links are in the video description. I'm Dave the Usher for the Game Replay. Stay tuned for the next part of Final Fantasy V. I will see you guys next time. I am out.